Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about hierarchy belongs to function. So hierarchy belongs to function is uh, another or alternate function to hierarchy uh, which I have shown in my previous videos. So if you see here the structure which is in place is from the hierarchy function. If I need to show you uh, very quickly which I showed you earlier in the video is this hierarchy where you specify what is child, what is parent ID and rest of the other parameters to basically create a hierarchy between the uh, series of data points or here in this case the different kind of designations that you have so that you can clearly segregate the designation one designation from another and create a hierarchy like this uh, from your data point. So this I have already explained how to achieve it. If you have not seen that video I will encourage you to see the Click view hierarchy part one video which I created some time back and here in this video as I said I will talk about hierarchy belongs to function which is uh, which serves basically a very special purpose so what is the purpose let me show you here by selecting uh, let's say CFO so if I'm selecting the CFO click view is behaving as it should have uh, like it is selecting the CFO related row showing you the relevant figure and whatnot but what if your business is saying that hey when you're selecting the CFO it's good that it is showing CFO but what I want to see is all the different hierarchies which is belonging to the CFO that means apart from showing the CFO it should show finance manager supervisor or any other thing which is coming under it so with that purpose the function name is also very similar which says hierarchy belongs to that means show me the hierarchy which belongs to CFO. So to achieve that let's quickly go to the edit script and here I will just uncomment this script which I have already written it for you just for the demonstration. So I will just comment the previously created hierarchy function comment it and I will uncomment the hierarchy belongs to function here in this case so which is very similar to the hierarchy function where we specify child ID parent ID designation we are again specifying parent ID which is again a part of the string to see ancestor ID ancestor name which is related to child or the parent and then the depth whether it is the highest level, the first level hierarchy, second level or third level. So I'll show you in the front end how, how it is behaving. So for now, let's quickly hit the save button, reload button and after running it, we'll click OK. So few of the things have become una unavailable because of the hierarchy belongs to function uh, as those features are not available. But what you can see is the designation column and the previously created that tree hierarchy which is not available. So it is clearly visible what you can achieve in the hierarchy function and, and uh, what you cannot but cannot achieve in the hierarchy belongs to function. So now let's go ahead and see the difference. So if I choose any of the value from the currently available filters, it will show me the changes as it was showing me in the hierarchy function. So if I'm selecting CFO, still it is showing me the CFO one. But the hierarchy belongs to function says that, hey, you need to show me CFO and all the below hierarchies, which is below the CFO. So to do that, what we have to do is we need to go into select fields and choose the parent name as the field to show this behavior. So if you see the parent name is similar to your designation, but it makes a difference because as you are seeing in designation field um, you have selected the CFO but here in the parent name you are getting CFO and MD which is saying that okay MD is kind of an upper profile as compared to the CFO like MD is the first one and CFO is the second one that's why both are coming. So what I'll do right now I'll uncheck this and I will check COO in this case. So now when I'm selecting the COO you are seeing that supervisor, operations manager and CEO, all three are coming and you can see the relevant aggregation of data. So if I select finance manager, 
finance manager and the supervisor is coming who is under the so basically supervisor is under the finance manager and if i select md which is top then everyone is coming uh, here in this structure so that's how uh, you can achieve your relevant business scenario in the uh, the hierarchy belongs to function which is very useful on those tricky scenarios where your business is asking that they just don't want to see uh, your selection but everything which is below to this hierarchy so that's pretty much all i wanted to discuss in this video and i'll meet you in a new video with a new topic